What's good, internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to my last play of WWE SmackDown vs. Raw 2007, and thus far have just fought guys like three times my size in the Big Show and Big Vist. Let's see, today, now that we are out of this Big Show feud, if today will be anything different. Cleaning up Raw. Kenny Omega on Raw. But maybe it's just Perry Saturn and Moppy. It's Candace. Hi, honey. It's Candace. I'm just calling to thank you for putting all of those moves on me uh, and showing me all of those holds this mm -hmm. weekend. You did a great job getting me ready for my singles match against Mickey tonight. I hope you'll be watching because I'm sure that we'll be putting on quite a show for the boys, especially boys like you. Bye. Bye. Okay. Well then. We're getting into a Divas storyline, I suppose. Let's head back out and see how that plays out this week. Oh, I get to play this match. Okay, sure. Candice versus Mickey. Well Hello, then. everybody to Monday Night Raw. This is good old JR Jim Ross here with Jerry the King Lawler at ringside. Coming to you live here tonight. And King, you know it's going to be a great show when it starts off with our Raw Divas. And the only thing better than one Raw Diva is two Raw Divas, JR. It's Mickey James and Candace Michelle in a singles match. Well, I hope you'll be able to make it through the broadcast, you Royal Romeo. Oh, don't worry about me, JR. I'm sure I'll be able to keep it going all night long. And I can't wait to see the Raw Divas do what they do best. And I know this capacity crowd can't either. Aren't they a little old for you, Jerry? Just saying. <clears throat> Oh, and there goes my capture kit, so that's a problem. So for some reason, my USB ports on my PC are having issues. I know it's not my capture kit, because my capture kit works just fine on my laptop, right? Um, but for some reason, on my desktop, my capture kit, uh, the USB is uh, not cooperating. Like, it won't stay connected, which is weird, and I don't like it. So, my apologies for that totally botching itself uh, during the thing. Thankfully, that this game, I do have the commentary turned on, so I can get up my audio sync back to where it should be anyway. Welcome. Missed that grapple. Welcome to a fine Sunday Battleground is this evening, uh, and I have up my Battleground predictions like on Friday, so I guess go watch those. Neck Breaker uh, from Candice Michelle, and then, you know, that's going to be a good time. Uh, there is kind of only really one news story, and that is the betting odds for some of the matches uh, for Battleground have changed. The the favorites in the matches have changed, uh, and that was two matches. Number one is the Usos are now, uh, the betting odds is towards them retaining and winning uh, with their title, which I don't see how it's going to happen when you have that numbers game from the New Day, but okay, sure. Um, that wouldn't surprise me. Uh, and then number two is for the women's fatal five-way. Uh, the current favorite now is Natalia, which I think perhaps they realize that, hey, if we're going to have Naomi fight somebody at SummerSlam, ideally, uh, that somebody should probably be a heel, considering that she is a face. Uh, so having Charlotte, who was the previous favorite to win, or having Becky Lynch win, you have a face versus face thing going on, and that's not going to be good for anybody. So, my prediction was Lana, because I just feel like they're going to do something stupid and have Lana win it again, and then have her challenge again. Um, would not surprise me, but uh, also having Natalia win also could be definitely a possibility. So, that's kind of really the only bit of news business here. Um, that's kind of... Referee, get some control. Get some control, referee. Re reverse the... Reverse a thing. Reverse a thing. I hate you. I hate you guts. Oh, poke in the eye. Poke in the eye. Here's the part where don't know how to win the match because reasons. I learned these... What? No. I learned these new moves from Attack Slug. Totally. What? Yeah. Do a thing. Nope. Got reversed. Into that headlock. Yep. That's what the fans want to see. More side headlocks. Some of these camera angles are not great. Not great. Not great. 
Alright, let's see if we can't figure out how to do a finishing move here. Because, oh! Crossface! From Mickey James, who is gonna get her finisher here if I can't get mine to work. Um, that's gonna be a problem. She gonna pin me here? No, just back back with another headlock. She's gonna tap me out if I'm not careful. If I'm not careful, I'm gonna get tapped out here. Tip, tip, tip. Uh, can I get up? No? Yes? Back into a headlock! What is with these? I'm gonna end up tapping here because these freaking headlocks are just my head is in the deep red and that's not cool. That's not cool. There we go. What the heck? Chun Li business there. That was her finisher, I guess. Oh no, the Mick kick! The Mick kick! That's it. I'm done here. I'm sorry, Candace. I didn't teach you enough cool stuff and you got pinned by Mickey James. Whatever. The losing streak Would continues. But oh, man. they're both happy so they be about it. Best as wait, what? It looks like Lita and then Lita is the here to... Wait. What is even... The only thing better than two but they were so happy to be in a match. Like, we had a match. And Lita's just like, nah. Nah. This is wrestling. You're not friends. This is wrestling. Hey, Lita! What are you doing? And... What the... It's Stephanie McMahon! Oh no. Lita, hey, Steph. that was perfect. It's about time someone cleaned up the filth, perversion, and exploitation I mean, of women here on Raw. I mean, look at what you're wearing, Steph. Just, just WrestleMania saying. And WrestleMania only four weeks away, this is the perfect time to do a little house cleaning. It sounds like Stephanie McMahon made it her personal mission to clean house here on Raw. I've got nothing against a woman who wants to do a little house cleaning, but this is just wrong. <sighs> In more ways than one. Hi, it's Tori. Listen, I'm really looking forward to your match tonight. Wait. I'm looking forward to spending some time with you afterwards even more. What? So don't work too hard because you might need to save some of that energy for later on, mister. Good luck. Okay. So first Candace, then Tori, then Viscera. What's wrong with this picture? Yeah, all right, all right. No! No! All right, Big Viss, what do you want? Here, you tax slug. We're pacing up in a match tonight, but don't worry, dog. It's all good. Once we're done entertaining those fans, we'll hook up with some of the dealers and keep the entertainment going all night long. See you in the ring, Big Viss. That's, that's hilarious to me for a number of reasons. But why can't I fight somebody more in my own weight class? Why is it Big Show and Big Viss? Uh, I'm just going to keep losing here. I'm just going to keep losing. It's terrible. Well, I guess the show rolls on. We have an overall of 49, and we get to go fight Big Viss for reasons. Again, the world's largest love machine is going to... Yeah. Considering what happened the last time I got into the ring... The with Big Viss. Uh, I don't have any aspersions to greatness for this match at all. Here we go again. He seems pretty mad about it. Don't know why. Ring the dang bell. Time to fight the dang Viss. Why is he just... I'm gonna wait for it. I'm gonna wait for it. Alright, well... Anyway. Anyway. Uh, again, there's not much else going on news-wise. Uh with Battleground happening this evening and our road to SummerSlam uh, in a couple of weeks here. Uh, should be definitely something to watch for because I'm, I'm curious to see how that, that shard, that shard, that, that card shapes up in terms of your main event matches. Uh, what? Wheelbarrow suplex. Sure, Big Viss, sure. Like, at this point, I'm a freaking play toy because he's so much... Bigger than I am. Like, also my stats are at 49, so not going to help me at all. Like, if I get in, in any offense here, it's going to be uh, shocking. It's shocking amounts of offense. So, tap any button repeatedly. Just keep slapping the big man. Just keep slapping. So, how much in this game, because I'm sure a lot of you guys might, might, might know, how much in this game... Do wins and losses actually matter? Is it like modern day wrestling where they don't matter at all? Or is it like the old games where they actually will branch you into a much crappier storyline? Uh, because I'm, I'm, I'm just curious. Like, I'm sure at some point I will have my stats at a suitable level to be able to, you know, win matches and hopefully not against super heavyweights. 
because that'd be nice. Um, but so far, it's been me and five star slug splash misses. It's been me and, and all these super heavyweights, which is, uh, you know, I have an, moves that can do some damage, but look, I'm in, I'm in, oh, I'm in yellow in my chest area already, and this is just not, he's just, he's fine. He is the most fine. And there's that big giant uh, kick from big giant Viss. That just, my head now is in the yellow. So, you know, this is going right well. Another wheelbarrow suplex. Um, and here we go. Here is this disturbing bit of business once again. And, yep, it's, it's just wrong. It's just wrong. Ready to end from ashore. It's, man. I don't remember him doing that at all, and I probably blocked it up. I blocked it out of my memory, cause it's just plain wrong. But don't worry, we're gonna get them divas. I kicked out. I kicked out. Big Vis can't believe it. He is in shock. So he's gonna work the leg. Sure. Okay. He is in absolute shock that anyone would kick out of that maneuver. Uh, it is insane. Anyway, yes, I'm probably going to start recording these on my laptop uh, instead of my desktop because for whatever reason, USB uh, on my desktop, and it doesn't, it doesn't matter which which port has been having a problem. I've got to like, uninstall all the USB ports and then reinstall them, and it's a whole thing I've just been putting off, only because usually when it drops, it drops when the thing's not recording. This is the first time I actually dropped during a recording session, so that's kind of troubling. Uh, that's going to be the case moving forward. So, you know, the thing with YouTube is that people don't really realize the amount of technical stuff that has to happen and line up and be consistently, you know, uh, uh, there's a there's a certain level of consistency that is a pain in the ass to achieve here on YouTube. And Big Vest just, nope, gonna pin me. Oh, kicked out. It is just, I don't know. Making things happen on YouTube and making them happen at a, you know, high video quality and fidelity without things falling apart is kind of a pain. So, you know, I, I do what I can, but, you know, I, ah, uh, again, no, there are children watching. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. That man has a family. Ah, uh, good God almighty. That's, I can't. I can't. The slow motion. I can't. I can't. Just pin me. Just, just let it be over. Just let it be over. I'm not even gonna bother kick kicking out. I'm not even gonna bother. I, I just want it to be over. All right, Vess, you beat me again. Sure. Obviously, and then there's no hard. There's feelings. No hard, these there's two. No hard feelings. Nice hard feelings. Uh, well, they know what's really important in life. So, fellas, have all the love. You're not telling me anything I don't already know, Jr. You're talking to one of those guys right now, King. You don't Bye. Really expect us to. Wait, Kurt Angle. What's this? It's true. Yes. Yes. Oh my gosh! It's Kurt Angle. Angle lock. I don't get it, Jr. What's Angle's problem? He wants to clean up the filth on Raw. Intensity, integrity, and intelligence. Yeah. Angle pledges support for the raw cleanup. We're going PG, folks. And we're cleaning it up. Attack Slug didn't even care about the match he had with Visra last week, says Angle. No, I want to win, Kurt. I'm just having a problem with guys that are twice my size, three times my size, and have much better stats than I do. So either I can clean up my act, or I can find out how much of a player he can be with a broken freaking ankle. All right, Kurt Angle, with your broken freaking condom. Ridiculous. But I feel like I'm tempting fate here the longer I sit here and record on the desktop with the USB. So I'm going to wrap it up here for this fine Sunday. I'll make a few changes for Moveset Monday, even though it's the only episode before I haven't had a whole week of this moveset just yet. But I'll see what I can do. Uh, I'm a tax slug. Thanks for watching. More videos every day. And I'll see you next time right here on this channel. And I'm out.